All it's right. nine in the afternoon. <laughs> Your eyes are the sign of the moon. You're good because you can't. French. All right. Maybe they drunk too. <laughs> Welcome back to Can You Not? It's Shelby <laughs> said that. It's our. <laughs> 50th episode ever. We're old. And we're all Fitty. drunk as hell. Fitty. I don't know about Fitty. as hell. Fitty. I don't know about we're, as hell. We're varying I'm degrees. drunk as heaven. We're varying degrees. <laughs> <laughs> we have Amber. We have Ooh. Brian. We even have Jesse. And Shelly. Hey, Jesse. Hey. Squad. Jesse is back and better than ever. Ooh. We sang Black Parade earlier. <laughs> It it's was pretty great. great. When your boy can master emo and trap at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> There's and it is one of, Jesse. And it is, of course, <laughs> our, our 2016 Can You Not Awards. The main three of us have chosen our, our biggest contenders of the don't year. Do it. Should I just open up a notebook? Don't That's don't how you do know it. it's serious. I always, I always, I always keep a notebook. <laughs> so broke. And I feel like Joe like traveled around the world in 80 days with this notebook. <laughs> He took notes on everything. (laughs) Well, here's the thing. I actually re-listened to our 2015 Can You Not Awards Mm. just to get some idea what was going on. And I noted some interesting things. First of all, I was reading off uh, an article that Yahoo had done. Yahoo. That that memes that will never get old. (laughs) And the meme that will never get old in 2015 was Donald Trump's hair. And oh, how the times have changed. (laughs) It won't get old. (laughs) At least it's for so the next old. four years. I think it's old as hell. <laughs> it's old as hell. Uh, some of our picks. Now that the... we found out it's real, like that's his actual. I don't know name. if I believe it. I don't know but they Deanna's messed it up on what's him call it. Some they of... like messed up his hair on uh, one of those like. Uh, nice Jimmy Fallon. So, yeah. I, so I definitely seen the wind and it pushed part of it up. <laughs> yeah, that's oh, just yeah. how he combs it over. It's well, weird. That looks horrible. Anyway, but anyway, some of our contenders this for mask, the Can You Not Awards last year included Amber bringing Ooh. up Mountain Dew Wings. Ooh. Oh, I forgot about <laughs> that. Uh, Jesse brought I would up. Eat uh, those right now. Jesse brought Mountain up. Mountain Dew. Jesse brought up Hulk Hogan, Iggy Azalea, the Hillary Clinton campaign's uh, advertising. Oh. <laughs> I brought up the fact that there was a dude um, who started a fire by accident in Missouri, tried to drive over it, forgot that his car had ammunition all in oh the back God, of it. Oh my God, I forgot Did it blow it. up? And it blew up. Oh. <laughs> Let's have him do that Just again. Just a rephrase. And also, Just this little phrase that I would like started. to play back to Mr. Jesse Keating. <laughs> The beards the were beard. just out of control. I'm super into the glitter Insane. beards. I hate the I'm glitter beards. I'm super into the glitter beards. <laughs> I think they're gross. I thought I was your glitter beard, Jesse. Excellent. Jesse completely trashes glitter beards. And yet for Halloween 2016, he wore a glitter beard to all the Jesse. bars that we went to. Jesse. What? <laughs> Jesse had a change of heart. <laughs> First of all, first of Things all, change first, of all, rank first of all, so this is messed up. <laughs> this is messed up that y'all are calling me on y'all stuff. Because let me tell you, how many times have you contradicted yourself in an episode, Joseph? That's true. Don't let me Ooh, comfort. He hit you with a Joseph. Don't let me comfort that ass, boy. I will you know it's real when he hit you with a Joseph. I just thought that was funny that he went from like ever whoring glitter beers to this. You're like hmm. completely embracing the Things glitter beers. Well, you just you need to own it. So do I. It doesn't matter what other people do. You just need to own it. Once okay. Jesse owned it. Okay, I did it. I did it. Okay. You guys have the receipts on me. Okay, I feel you. Y'all have. But the you're receipts. wearing you're wearing a Monet shirt. Yeah, the receipts. Fam. Ooh. Fam. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> My can you not? We, I, I, for people who didn't tune into the last episode, we instantly disqualified Donald Trump because he epitomizes can you not to every he's degree. He's the last. Can he's not. a little too obvious. He's a little too on the nose. He's everything we can not. Oh, hey girl. Yes. Um, but my choice for this year is Paul Ryan, a uh, a the lim- Zodiac killer. A lit. No, no, no. That's Ted Cruz. <laughs> There's two of them now. Paul Ryan is a, a is a limp, moist noodle of a man. You just said moist. Wait, 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 wait. You wait, called wait, a man wait. boy. 
moist. Wait, 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 wait. You called him moist and limp. <laughs> yeah. And the noodle. <laughs> so, he's a limp, moist noodle. Amber, you do not have to be my beard. Joe is my beard sitting next to me. <laughs> he's a limp, oh. moist noodle of a man. <laughs> That's so gross. I'm gonna start calling people that. That's my new insult. You are, you are one noodle. limp, moist noodle of a man. No. You body? Yeah. It's really oh my god. So why? See, why? see, here's the thing. He tried to play all coy during the Obama presidency. Oh He's trying to be all Saudi, sort of like. Oh, I'm, I'm moderate. You know, I listen to both sides. I can work with both people. And yet... <laughs> this is going to be hard to do. I don't know what we thought of doing this. <laughs> Charles is <laughs> so let's, all, let's all take a deep breath. Over. Everybody in? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? Jesse did not. Shelby did not take a deep breath. What? <laughs> No, he'll say like if Trump says something bad, he'll be like, "Oh, I don't condone it." But then he still was like supporting him all the way every mm. single time, no matter what he said. He would say, "Oh, I don't like how he said this," and then he would still support him. And now, he's much completely... like every Trump supporter, I was going to say, didn't like every Republican candidate do that? Women Not for Trump, them, though. You'd be surprised. There were a few like <laughs> people like John McCain Algorithm stood up against no. Trump well, and said, "I'm not John voting McCain, for him." I don't know. No. If somebody says like he was a Mitt person Romney. of war, I Mitt prefer Romney. not to support people who were prisoners of war. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. I feel like John McCain, but like, what's God? I can't remember anybody's name, but like, I feel like yeah, Trump kind of went directly of, at John McCain. A lot of them McCain. like were directly insulted by him, but then turned around and supported them because he was a Republican candidate. Mitt right. Romney didn't. Mitt Romney, I don't, I don't have But then he turned around and had dinner with Trump recently. It doesn't so mean anything, thing. though. He hasn't accepted a cabinet position. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, he got rejected. He's before. still Trump outwardly, he still position. outwardly does not accept yeah. Trump. I just think he has the, he has so much, but he, he so badly wants to cut all social security, all Medicaid. That's like been his wet dream forever. Are you talking about Chris? Wet no, 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 dream. No, Paul Ryan. Whoa. And he, now here's his chance and, and he's going to do whatever he wants. This 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 chopped up earthworm of a human being. <laughs> Yo, Paul Ryan, you are letting joke walk you roast your whole life right now. Get him. It's over for you. Get him. Chopped up earthworm <laughs> of a man. Did you, know, did you know that? Did you know that? If, uh, it's a myth that if you cut up an earthworm, all the pieces will be alive. Is it only like one half of it? That no, none system? of it. An earthworm not has a it? complicated no, internal system. Oh, it's gonna no. die if you cut it. Oh, it's terrible. She'll be chopping up earthworms. Dude, no, seriously, we did. We cut it and it was. Just because it's like still having a seizure doesn't mean no, it's alive. It was, oh, wait, no, never mind. We didn't cut it. It was having babies. Wait, wait. What? Wait. It was, it was really cool. Wait. It was really cool. It was having babies. She'll be watching so earthworms have babies. babies. I mean, I was like in second grade. It was really cool. I'm going to cut a person in half while they're no, having babies. No, no, oh. I didn't cut the worm in half. It was just having babies. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Amber got real gruesome. And you can see the little babies. The head of the worm may survive so and regenerate its tail if the animal is cut behind the selectium. The original the tail of the worm will not be able to grow in your head. Look at that. So can we do that? Can we try this? Yeah. On our first That's visual episode, let's cut. Why are we talking about? Who are we talking about? <laughs> Paul Ryan? Yes. Paul Ryan, Paul congratulations. Wait, you have I yielded a conversation about cutting that. worms in half. Cool. <laughs> Shout up, earthworm of a man. Mark Zuckerberg. Oh. Just released a video about how he it's like, not a sex tape, bro. Right? It's not a sex tape. <laughs> Good. But he did Stop. create an AI in his house yes. to like maintain the temperature AI. and do all kinds I'm of stuff. I'm too drunk to know what it is. Artificial, Artificial intelligence. intelligence. Okay. It's, it's, like, it's, okay. Like, it's like Siri for your I house. I get it. Why and is that the one Siri where so where he was talking about using, uh, what's the name? Tony Stark guy. No, no, no. It was uh, Morgan Freeman's voice. <laughs> Oh. So like the video starts with him waking up and it's Morgan Freeman telling him the temperature of his room and stuff. What and the then fuck? like he goes into his daughter's I think daughter? Yeah. Son? His child's yeah, his room. Uh, the child's name is Max. Hi Max. And like Morgan Freeman is teaching Max Mandarin. What the f 
And then he like goes to his closet and he's like. Did he like, pay Morgan Freeman to do this? I don't I think so. Yeah. But he like, and then he's like, um, I'm ready to get dressed now. Oh, uh, it's like Jarvis. It's Jarvis. Yeah. And then he's like, for, for, for the um. Yes. Yeah. That's what he, it came from. He has a t-shirt cannon in his closet that shoots well, well, his shirts on. into his hand. I mean, that was a comedy video, though, to be fair. Play. It was a really bad comedy video. So, okay, <laughs> He's not a good actor. He's a dork. Wait, it's a joke or it's real life? Is this on YouTube? It, it's the, the technology is somewhat real, but it was portrayed as a joke. Okay, okay. So, so it was a joke video, but okay. he actually programmed Jarvis. Mark Zuckerberg said. House. Which is similar to Siri, right. so he can like talk to it and right. it recognizes what he's saying, and right. then like if he wants it to make him toast, it will. So like on top of this mm. super stupid video that Mark Zuckerberg released of his like million dollar life, he also is part of the reason Trump got elected because Facebook just feeds you fake news. Yeah. Um, what? So my True. person, my can you not of the year, even though Mark Zuckerberg really isn't that bad of a person, he did a dumb video, so that made me hate him. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he like, one of the things he did, first of all, he did the Morgan Freeman's voice thing, and like, I want Morgan Freeman to narrate my life. has been a joke forever, and he yeah. actually did it. Yeah. And then on top of that, he made like a Nickelback sucks joke. So he what? feels like that kid. Yeah. He was, he, he's like, Jarvis, play me all the good Nickelback songs. And then Jarvis was like, I'm sorry, I can't do that. There are no good Nickelback songs. So he's like wow. just, he's just pandering and it hurts me. He's yeah. like. It's like circa 2008 jokes. Yeah. Right, it's like, it's like he's that kid nobody likes. So he thinks that being rich and then making jokes that everybody already thinks are funny will make it okay. Right. No, so that made me angry. And then on top of that, <laughs> like even though he's mostly a good person, like just reading his Wikipedia page, he's I don't have a problem with him. Mm -hmm. But. Facebook contributed so much to the false news problem yeah. that occurred in this election. And he refuses to take acknowledgement of that. He's right. so blind. That he keeps on saying, oh, Facebook didn't have anything. No, no, no. No, and then, like, now he has a feature, and I give him points for trying, where you can mark false news. Yeah. Like, you can do that now. I don't have Facebook Making anymore. Small trials, but but it's like these baby steps, but still yeah. Trump is the president, and that's, like, basically the apocalypse. She's exactly. done that a long time ago. Right, so Mark Zuckerberg is my nomination for this. This right. year it was really hard for me because there were so many people. Everybody is trying but then, this but then year. I thought of like I thought of someone that I've constantly defended over time, and now I can't, and that's Kanye West. Oh, that's right. Oh, so that's like, up. so like personally for me, Kanye West. That was West, one of my runner-ups. Yeah, like for me, Kanye West made me listen to hip hop. Like. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like college dropout made me want graduation. to rest. Graduation, yeah. all those graduation. albums. Oh graduation's a really graduation. great album. Yeah. Late registration's a really great album. Yeah. My twisted dark fantasy. Like you can name your favorite top five Kanye albums, and our whole generation at least Eight knows ways. one of them. Right. right. Everybody knows Kanye. Everyone right. knows Kanye. Right. And the fact you know, like he went from being the one that said like. FEMA does not care about black people. George W. Bush does not care about black right. people. And he was so woke at the time. Right. And now we're at the point where he is signing off of Trump. Yeah. Exactly. He and said he doesn't vote. He said yes. Trump. Trump 2024. Is yeah, Trump. what the <laughs> fuck? So like for me. 24. So like for, so like for me, that hurt me so much. Cause like, because like think about this, like before Kanye, it was like no one was wearing a pink polo and getting away with it. Like no one was out here with backpacks and teddy bears and rapping hard. I mean, it to reminds me of, of the song that J. Cole put out. What was, was it Everybody Dies or, no, Everybody Dies was the other one about Lil Uzi, but, uh. I know what you're talking about, though. False idols. Yes, false, false prophets. prophets. False prophets. Oh, yeah. To be fair, right be like right after he said that, he ended up in the hospital. It's like the anniversary yeah. of his mother's death. Yeah. Like, he's like, I think. It's before. I think a lot of it is you know his I mean? mother's it's like, death. It's like around. I'm just. I mean, I'm it's not hard. trying to. It's so I think hard. a lot of it is is uh, at least from what I've read about the whole situation with Kanye kind of going crazy. It's it has a lot to do with his mother's death, but right, so a big part right of it is that. as much as we all hate her, Kim Kardashian is Kanye's wife, mm -hmm. and he has two children her. with the well, not hate her, but you know what I mean. It's like, this I, like the image she puts out. I don't think it has anything to do with that. But me. I mean, I'm saying like she's his wife, and the fact that people. <coughs> 
people close to Kanye talk all the time about how uh, he's very protective of his wife and children. Yeah. And the fact that all these people that he put in charge of protecting his wife and children weren't able to when it came down to people coming in with guns and tying his wife up and making her feel like she was about to be raped. Did that you know happen? what I mean? Yeah, yeah. they got all the jewelry. She got robbed. Oh yeah, I forgot yeah. about that. I just, so, I just know he ended up in the hospital, like right yeah. after he so, said that. So that kind of feeds into the distrust of people, and you know that's kind of fueled at the, uh, Donald Trump's campaign. Too. At, at the same time, like Kanye West raised a bunch of black children yeah. to mm-hmm. think differently yeah. at a time where it was like hyper masculinity, gangster violence. Yeah. Like mm-hmm. he was such a different person to come through and honestly if you've never seen the video of him calling out george bush during katrina it's like you, oh my it's like it <laughs> hurts michael so myers much. was terrified he was like, like yeah, yeah. Uh, like yeah. because because literally like kanye west went off the script he's like george bush hates black people and like, it's true he was like, it was true oh my god it's yeah, it's yeah. so intense like and like he went from being someone that was like i'm going to drop a record called jesus walks and no one's gonna play it and it became number it, one exactly yeah. and he, he went and he, from being the underdog everybody to being the one that was like so consumed with his own ego it's just it's well, he's mm-hmm. a nerd. Everybody knows it's just it's just, yeah, it's just exactly. disappointing because it's like he showed black boys how to come up with different kind of like joy yeah. Like mm-hmm. and showed like black girls how you can be talked about differently yeah. and yeah. records and now we're at a point where it's like the life of Pablo is bull to me. Yeah, it's bull. Yeah. Jesus, yeah. Jesus, yeah. true. <laughs> but the like, fact that he, the fact that he knows that everyone really wants the old Kanye back and he understands why. But he still is giving us. Well, Jesse, weren't you and I saying like some of the singles leading up to it were like this album is gonna be the only, yes. you know, like yes. he's gotten back to this old, he's gotten in connection with what real he used friends, to be. right? Mm-hmm. Like, real friends was great, right? Like, yeah, but it, then it just it turned around real quick, and then yeah. you hear songs like Facts, yeah, right. like that's pointless to me. I just like for me, it hurts so much because that was my go-to artist. That like it's like inspired- Life of Pablo is like a skip through album, yeah. Well, he inspired you to get into Hip-hop. music at all, right? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, like for right? me, like before I grew up, and this is no surprise to some of you, I grew up on country and neo soul. That's a weird mm-hmm. combination. <laughs> That's a weird combination. Through then, the Wire was for me like that was the, the go-to hip hop song. Like that cool. was really the song that got me in. The fact that he literally yeah. he made a song about. Him going through. going through yeah. something yes. crazy. Yeah. He and was literally leading the booth. through the leading wire. in the booth. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> and it's just yeah. like he was your rapper's favorite rapper that happened exactly. to be on the radio. Yeah. So like now it's like us as black folk, it's like he inspired so many, like Chance and all these other rappers sure. to do what they want to do. Right. But it's to it see hurts. where Chance is and to know that he came from Kanye. It's and awesome. to see where Con- Kanye they, they, is now it's is disappointing. It's they very passed, scary. Yeah. They've passed. He's, I feel like Jesse and I were talking about this the one day. We we're saying it almost feels like Kanye was always so ahead of the times. He always was like looking forward. He always had the next thing that would become the yeah. next big thing. Right. And now it feels like he's just constantly grabbing in the past. It doesn't yeah. feel like he's, in, you know, looking forward in the same way. It feels like. Or if he is looking angry. forward, you're scared for what your future is. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I agree. Yeah. And it's just it's at the point where we have to realize that like, our <laughs> black superhero is now just a bleached out carcass. So my first one was Kanye. For many of the same reasons that Jesse said. But uh, my next, my runner up, I guess, kind of, would have to be Black China. Oh my God. Black China. She's married to Rock. For everything that her friend Amber Rose did for for slut shaming or for body positive people. Yeah. Black China is like taking women a step back, yeah. and that really hurts me. Well, especially since the fact that. Oh, sorry. I, didn't mean I mean, Black China kind of feeds it. Like we've talked about people that like will claim that they've been raped or claim that they've right. been abused. Right. Black China is basically one of those people. Yeah. yeah. She literally was texting her friend talking about how she would use Rob Kardashian 
for a year. Even though how much like people talk about the Kardashians and how they're not a good influence. Rob Kardashian is not a bad person. No, he is he's just a man. He's like a sweet guy. And you used, you literally used his name. The fact that she thought she would be able to take the Kardashian name and he was a for good herself. One. Right, yeah. he was the good one. And she thought she would be able to take it for <laughs> Amber raises her. <laughs> She's like, I need clarification. I don't know who Black China is. Okay. She so. robbed, she married Rob Kardashian. She robbed Rob Kardashian. <laughs> she did. She did. She she okay, did okay. Here's a, here's I saw you just, just like, I need the download. Okay, let me, give, you, let me give you the let me give you the tea. So okay. a biography of Black China. I, she used to dance at a strip club yeah. called King of Diamonds. Shut she up. was like the lead scripper. She's best okay. friends with there. Amber Rose. Yeah. The, I know who Amber Rose okay, is. Okay. And then she also married the rap or not married, but had a kid with the rapper named Ty Tyga. Tyga. Mm-hmm. Okay. Who is dating Kylie. Yeah. Jenner. Kylie Jenner. It's how weird this so, is. Okay. So they have a kid together and Rob and Black China now have a kid together. Yeah. So, so now they're, they're double uncles. Mother's. Double uncle auntie's mother. Yeah. That's a there's layers to there's this. Rob, Car- Rob, Rob Kardashian is the fat one. Yeah, the fat The fat mother. brother. That is like the most down to earth dude that doesn't want spotlight, Mm -hmm. but now is getting all the spotlight because of Black China. Exactly. So, so which thing is the thing that she did that? So she basically took advantage of Rob, and she wants to trademark the Kardashian name. Yeah. Okay. She she took all this food and the baby. Okay. She took so his, she's just trying to take advantage of the name and like she make money married him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She yeah, married him literally to get the Kardashian exactly. name. Exactly. And to be able to use it for business yeah. and social purposes. Yeah. Hmm. Then Black China she even Black. planned on doing this from yeah. from the first time she met Rob Kardashian. Yeah. She said that she was going to use him for a year. Then she took his baby and left him recently. Right. And there was this whole thing about Rob Kardashian on Snapchat using all these jokes to try and like f- make himself feel better. But she took his child. Right. Okay. This not only does this do bad things for women, right. but for all the things that you see terrible about black women in the like media. Because she's like a role model. He it, basically. Exactly. Okay. And this so many. There are so many things that I see on social media that are not true and so, like, awful about yeah. black women and other cultures in general. But, like, when you see people like like uh, Black China who basically make it all look like it's real, yeah. you know what I mean? It's just awful. I deleted well, line. You know what's funny thing too Instagram. is Bryce. I remember at the beginning of this year, Bryce actually sent me a whole article where someone was defending Black China. Shout like out a, to Bryce. A really brilliant. I love Bryce. <laughs> Bryce is great. As a, like, we a really, all like Bryce a lot. <laughs> as a really bri- brilliant uh, person in terms of how she like got to where she was, and I was like, okay, this is cool. Like she really, but then like after this whole thing where she just stuck the baby and all the shit, like all the food, like oh my god, like it doesn't make me want to root for her. She really. literally took. All of his food. Yeah, and like oh my his God. All of too. the food like out of the pantry. He goes all of the food out of both of their fridges and and freezers. It's terrible. She literally took everything. Like and his child. And here's yeah, the worst part. His child. Here's the worst part. So now white people see black women in such a way where it's like, okay, so they're only judged based upon their bodies, like all women. Exactly. But now that they're seen as an accessory to white men, one. Two, they're seen as predatory to white men, too. And three, we're now at this situation where it's like, wow. So now black women are intrinsically untrustable. Exactly. Reasons to hate and black women. Like, black women have always got, honestly, black women have always got the short end of the stick. Everybody right. says, like, says, like, you know, oh, this is when women got the right to vote, but that was white women. You know, everybody, like, it's always in the Amber's white so perspective. Woke. Reason no, why I love I Amber. Amber. I love about things with this whiteness this whiteness pair of glasses on like as soon as white men have the right vote who even cares what else happens and it's such nonsense like so now we're in the situation where black like, women have always come last and always and, and black china you are keeping them there black, yeah. you are keeping them there and i black china and i just want to say like hearing her story of how she came up like it's extraordinary at the same time it's like do Man. better. Do, Do better. better. Like, all you can really judge people on is their actions. And exactly. as soon as you start pulling stuff like that, it's like, well, what do you want me to think of you? Like, this is what you're doing. And now we're in a situation where it's like the black community views the Kardashians 
in such a way where it's like, can we trust you? Right. But now it's like, dang, Black China, can we trust you? Right. So, ooh, 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 ooh chill out, girl. Ooh. The ginger ale's in the fridge. She's like, she's like I am so heated oh, about so this situation. Yeah. I want to keep it cold. Can I get ooh. some? Dude, do it. Okay. So, gimme, gimme. So, Black China you gets the Black award. Last year we talked about some of the biggest memes and trends of the year, and I want to kind yes. of go over some. Oh, okay. Uh, so I found a couple memes. lists here. Hood clips. <laughs> Shout out hood clips. So you are a messy girl. we have here on Daily Dot. <laughs> They mentioned the Boston Market cornbread. God, what the fuck is going on, guys? You, y'all, so lit, man. I'm Shit. really sorry I spilled whiskey and ginger ale on your couch. It adds to the stains on the couch, <laughs> to be so honest. Stains on this couch. It's really strong, though. Fuck, what did I do? I'm a, I'm a, hey, right. come through. Come okay, through. Yes. Yes. Come hey. through. We have I'm making a mess. I'm sorry, Joe. The, will you things. start over? Yes, yes, yes. I talk about the latest me- the memes and trends of 2016. One of them was Damn Daniel, which I still don't know. Damn Daniel. Damn Daniel. White man. Damn Brian. Damn Brian. Damn Brian. Damn Brian. Back with the spilling God, again. You're everywhere. Jesus, he did worse <laughs> than me. That's what she said. You're but everywhere. Stuff all over y'all, y'all lit with this. Y'all <laughs> came through. Shut up. You're supposed to tell. <laughs> what are you? <laughs> Further on, further on, we have Ted Cruz as the Zodiac Killer. <laughs> oh, that was great. That hey, was why are you telling me? We had Joe Biden as the greatest Trump oh. Trump troller of all time. Joe Biden just likes ice cream. I love Uncle Joe. I Bill. like ice cream too. <laughs> God, the thing on Joe's screen that trusted, but it says trust Ted for tre- I want Ted Cruz. Oh my God, not the Zodiac Killer. And then remember the the Bernie versus Hillary? Meeting? Yes. Where it was like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, does this say lizard? It's like, listen to Waka Flocka Flame. I want to see. So, like, here's one where it says, like, topic lizards. Bernie says, hell yeah, I love these little guys. And Hillary just says, no. <laughs> <laughs> that be was on here. And then it's, then it's like Radiohead. Bernie says, OK Computer is one of the defining albums of the 90s. And the decision to release Kid A immediately after will go down as one of the most important moments in rock history. And Hillary says, I love Creep. <laughs> <laughs> Olive Garden. Bernie says, only when I'm high. And Hillary says, an authentic Italian restaurant for the whole family. <laughs> Do you remember when we all hated Hillary and she was our Jordan only meme. Remember when Jordan she wasn't meme. the last hope of any sort of democracy? Def- in the the Jordan meme better be next. Is Jordan oh, yeah, meme next? Crying Jordan. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> so, it was... Uh, MJ's crying face from his uh, Hall of Fame like induction. 2009, which is weird that it decided to pop up this year. And then, of course, you, Dat Boy. Yes. Dat yes. Boy! <laughs> oh, shit! I don't know Dat cycle. Boy. That's a frog on the unicycle. And just, oh, shit, it's Dat Boy. Yes, There's a guy it. on the unicycle. What? A frog on the unicycle. Oh, boy. And the whole thing is just, oh, shit, it's boy. Dat Boy. I get it. Uh, fake concert events on Facebook. Oh, those were good. Did you guys hear about the fake pit bull one? No. That was no. like in Anchorage, Alaska. <laughs> and he ended up flying there or something? Oh, it wasn't fake because they had a poll. They said, where do you want oh, to yeah. perform? And they went to Anchorage, Alaska. And it was like 22 like, people. It was like at a Walmart where he performed. <laughs> it's like the Bodie McBoat face thing. Bodie McBoat God, I hate the internet. Oh, uh, but I love the internet. So. Arthur memes. Oh, Arthur, Arthur memes. Oh, Arthur. Oh. So did you guys? Did you guys ever see the guy who dressed up as the Arthur yes, meme? Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you guys see the Asian guy? He's just like this. That was funny. He was really also, I love the DW ones too. Ben Affleck. Do you remember that one? Oh what? my God! That interview. They, they interviewed him on the set of like uh, Superman, or, Batman versus Superman. Yeah, we say. Harambe. Oh. No! Oh, What's your job? Harambe got it, I'm just saying, that's on the list. Cincinnati soon deleted guru. their Twitter over Harambe. That's can so we, crazy. Can we throw this in a recycle bin? That was such a weird thing to me, because remember how people were outraged about the fact that it happened, and all of a sudden it became this weird, twisted thing where everyone was making fun of it, as opposed to like before where they were overreacting to it? It's such a weird meme. Like, White people and so their animals, odd. man. I don't. People and their animals. They're really happy. They're like 
really? Then people start making fun of it also. What like, would Harambe do? Literally, stop? Cincinnati Zoo deleted their Twitter because they were like, I'm done with oh, it. Yeah. I bet. I would too. That's crazy. Get yourself a man who can do both. Me. It's a big one. I forgot about that. I'm is that, that, is that 2016? You're not yeah, a man. Yeah, yeah. Kermit versus evil Kermit. That was Kermit. a beautiful Kermit. That's my favorite meme, bro. I Kermit versus evil Kermit. Those are my favorite memes. memes. Kermit like, memes. Like the Kermit sipping tea. Shout out to Jamal, who I called a Muppet this year. <laughs> he is a Muppet. He does look like a Muppet. He does look like a Muppet. That's he looks amazing. like the Muppet from the Muppet the movie. Oh, the but he's awesome. Yeah. Am I a man? I like how they have a bitmoji of the no. Arctic fish. Nope. Trump the Trump Pepe was, was stupid. Was I didn't see it. Can I see it? I didn't yeah. see it. Yeah. The, the, All the racist the people took over Pepe. Oh, yeah. I didn't see Pepe. that one. They, I, inter- they interviewed the guy who made up Pepe the Frog. I and they were like, it. how do you feel? And he was like, God, I don't even know. I'm He's so like, sad. I don't think they need a symbol of love. And, and, <laughs> But I love oh my god, the name of more iconic duo. Oh, I, love it. I can keep going. Okay, okay, pause, pause, pause. What even was that? It was, it was, was, to me, it was like those are the Jenner girls. Yeah, the Jenner girls, and people would put like other people. I like no, Michael I, I and always, Janet. I always, I always yeah. saw, I always saw name of more iconic Freaking Meredith duo. and and Dang Christina. Oh, yeah, no, sure. literally, I always saw that, but like the original thing, I literally shout didn't out know Megan, who they Beyonce were. and Kelly, not Michelle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. I, that oh, was the good. one where he was that was it. I feel like that was more interesting. Or the SpongeBob one with the the gorilla looking oh, like yeah. the caveman. Honestly, I feel like the SpongeBob memes were more innocent than like anything else yeah. that happened this year. Yeah. Oh, they were right. racist inadvertently. As, a, as an extra bit of humor, I noticed that in our Can You Not Awards 2015, the description says. Um, thank you for your support this year. Please keep tuning in for what's sure to be a fun and engaging 2016. Oh. <laughs> Please tune in for what should be the most depressing year of my entire life so I, far. I have not lived through a more depressing, no, I mean, Well, year. we haven't lived that long, so, you know. I mean, dude, I mean, Jesse and I always talk it's probably about not as bad as like whatever 1006 was. I s- but it, it, oh. so in modern history, no, but for real though, bad. Jesse and I was is it 2014 or 2013? 2013 was spring of that year, 2014, 2014. Spring of 2014 yeah. was the worst year, but then like this year, this whole year topped that semester somehow. I Amber was know. Amber. We both cried in the library for it was ten cut minutes. My life into pieces. We actually cried. This yeah. is my last resort. And she like. wore she wore <laughs> gloves without fingers on it. Dude, and the weirdest. Even, she had a she, she had a wristband. She I, had I a cuff. A, a cuff wristband, and I was like, I "Girl, it. what is your life coming to?" I was to? like, "Dude, I this semester." And then we cried for ten minutes. The final meme on this list: J Cole went platinum with no features. Oh my god! That's all you gotta say. It's like a picture of someone. That's all you gotta say. Here through a door with her saying, ma'am, I swear if you just acknowledge that J. Cole went platinum with no features, we won't ever bother you again. <laughs> I saw a picture of a, a, a guy that he, he was arguing with a brick wall and it said uh, arguing with J. Cole fans in 2016. Mm-hmm. That's me. Shelby, yes. Yeah, okay, true. just off the top of your head right now, if you had to pick a can you not award person, who would you pick? I don't know. Like just off the top of your who head, do like you not like who, as a celebrity, or like just as a person. Brian. Like what? we talked about Kanye. She's gonna say Brian. Why? <laughs> what are you yeah. talking about? I'm just wondering if you. I really been. thought the whole Black China thing. That's fair. That's really. She's what co-signing. It was. She's By co-signing. Way, basically. Yeah. I should mention that this episode is brought to you by Advanced Auto Parts. <laughs> oh, oh, this girl, hold on. This drunken episode is complete. Go ahead, go it's ahead. brought to you by Advanced Auto Parts. If you go to Advanced Auto Parts. If only they would have paid for the alcohol. Auto Parts. <laughs> what did he say? What did he say? What did he say? He said if only they'd have paid for the alcohol. <laughs> Wait, what? Shit! Show me so much. I missed it. If you go to advancedautooffer.com slash can you not, you can get 20% off your first order. That's How a lot of money. Is that? is that a slash or a backslash? Uh, that's, a, that's just a, that's a dash. 
That's going to be the new meme of 2016. Is it a dash or a hyphen? Is this a slash or a backslash? No, the slash bring slash. What is that? Hashtag slash. Hashtag chopped up earthworm of a man. Shut up. Advanced Auto Parts is the largest provider of auto parts in the entire country. And they totally want a bunch of drunk people to Yeah, they do. To drive their car straight into the building. Guys, where the. Where's Shut my up, phone? Don't do that. I don't Brian, know. Brian, are you sitting on my phone? Brian, Am what'd I? you say before? Can I ball? Can I cheer? Guys, what would you phone. say? Can I Brian, stand up? You want a drink? I can't move. Where's my phone? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Is it a bad Brian, room? stand up. What's your phone like? That's my phone. Is this spinning <laughs> on it? Where my phone go? Where my phone go? Where my, where my phone go? Where my phone go? Where my, where my phone? Hey, hey, hey. hey. Where my, where my, where my, where my phone go? Hey, hey, hey. 21 hey, Savage, hey, I'm asking hey, you right now hey, to guys. make that a song. Where, where, where my, where my, where my, where my phone? 21, 21. I got no soul. Where my fucking phone go? Hey, hey. I'm a savage because uh, I don't know where my phone go. <laughs> 'Cause he always been a savage. Hey, hey, he yeah. always been the one to create uh, damage. Uh, hey, uh, hey. Uh, 21, bro. 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, you that is joe's official nip oh metro pimp cool shit. Don't trust it's your me. new rap name <laughs> yo i need you to put another album out on spotify Bart. where your name is metro <laughs> pimp cool yes. stop he does not listen listen let's for the audience let's get this straight i have he has two albums I have I have two LPs in the EP, but yet I can't get on Spotify. This man has an LP on Spotify yeah, no. with a song called Pizza Bank. A soundtrack. He does. Hold up, Hello. he really does. Yes, he has two albums no, on Spotify. Listen, 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 listen. I need to tell you. What's his name on Spotify? Joe Kowalski. Okay, no, no, no. not I, Metro I, Pimp Queen. I, Story. I don't remember what year it was. Joe and I had been friends on Facebook for like a year, and I don't really remember why. I shared a Foster the People picture because I was at the concert, and Joe messaged me. He was like, I like Foster the People. Were you at that concert? And I was like, yeah, I was. And then we started talking, and then like we are like, let's hang out at a Panera. So we got like lunch at a Panera, and we were hanging out, and then all of a sudden, I don't even remember where Pizza Bank came from, but I really regret going to lunch with this asshole at Panera <laughs> because that Pizza Bank happened, and he made a song about it. And I hate it. It's on what? What is it on there? It's on Spotify. I looked up his name, I can't Spotify. <laughs> You should probably so, uh, so we've been going on for quite a while. You can find us on soundcloud.com slash podcast. You can find us on iTunes. We'll read please you on air. Please go. You can find us uh, on can you, uh, can you at gmail.com for any feedback or ideas. You can find me. <laughs> <laughs> it's so astounding. My heart is pounding. It truly I is a grindy of day. I only want to a live performance. Y'all don't understand. This okay, is real. Let's turn it off now. I say this. J is my Twitter. And it's by various artists. I'm Shelby Faith underscore 1997 at Instagram. In Instagram. We're on Twitter. Girl. We're on Instagram. You can, you can, let's make it. You can, you can still follow me on Instagram. What's your Instagram, Shelby? Shelby. You can faith underscore 1990. You can find me at 
uh, Jesse Paradise, J E S S E P A R A D I C E. You can find me on Wait, Bandcamp what? at Black Jesse. Not at, S E. You can I find you said D I C K. You yeah. can find me at jesseparadise.bandcamp.com. I just released a new EP. Don't call me ethnic. And then you can find me. And you can find me on the Twitter at Black Celtic at B L V C K C E. Ooh, C E C E L T I C. I was so close, Jesse. Girl, stick to the the engineering. Jesse, it was great to have you back. Can I have um, some of this? It was great. Yeah. This was amazing. How do I do this? How do I do this? So what I mix it <laughs> Mix it with something alcoholic. Ryan, I'm alcohol, alcohol. This, I'm this, so This whole episode is going to be incomprehensible. And I'm going to listen to it. There's nothing to mix it with. 21 Savage says the name is Joe. I mean, hey, all he be hey. getting is Metro all that dough. Hey. Pimp cool hey. shit. If young Metro Pimp cool shit don't trust you. He, we're going to put you in a soundtrack. And response. he ain't going to buy you no minute cards no, no more. No, hell no. And I'm officially following Joe Kowalski. Ooh, awesome. How Girl. can you not? Can you not 2016? Can you not 2016? Can you not 2016? Can you not, you not at all? Can you not my life? So terrible. And, and basically, Ooh. we don't know. Basically, the only one that might not be affected by a Trump presidency is Joe. Yeah. So, Can yeah. you not Trump? Oh, yeah. yeah. Trump, you automatically win. Trump I hope you know that. Win you win. He doesn't we we didn't, we didn't doesn't mention you because you, you don't even you deserve a mention. Win. You don't even deserve a mention. But now we're mentioning knows. you. It's so innocent to watch, listen to us Damn. in the Damn. 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 Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Peace out, 2016. Peace out, 2016. Please let us Oh, my God. Leave us alone. Do not call us ethnic. Goodbye, Don't call us ethnic yet. Don't call, ethnic yet. Yeah, don't don't call me ethnic. my black guy over here. My black token black And person. if you say the N word, best believe I'm going to whoop your you ass. You finna die. Up, B. Don't play you that shit. You finna die. Do not for play. Real, for real. Find me. Find me.